first up we have application accelerators. Now accelerators are accessible from right inside your IDE. So here I'm using VS Code, I'm generating a basic Java application but I don't have to leave. I can customize the application, I can decide where I'm going to store it and it will open that application straight into a fresh Visual Studio Code IDE window for me so I can get straight to work. Also new in Tanzu Application Platform 1.2 is the ability to take that brand new project and straight away put it onto the platform. So the platform will now build me a container image and it will run that container on Kubernetes for me just from a single click inside the IDE. It's also possible with 1.2 to see some very um, basic information about the workload itself while it's running on the platform by um, hovering over uh, certain annotations in your uh, Java code so that you can see here, for example, the um, endpoints that the application will be hosted on. Notice as well the new Tanzu workload panel in the bottom left corner there that's constantly monitoring the status of my workload on the platform. And now my app is ready, I can test it with a simple HTTP call. Also new is the Tanzu ignore file. This allows you to tell uh, the Tanzu application platform to ignore certain files and folders within your project. The live update feature has also had some improvements as part of the platform's 1.2 release. Now, thanks to the Tanzu Ignore file, the whole process of pushing your code onto the platform for live view is much faster than before. And also, there's more visibility now thanks to the Tanzu workload panel that you can see in the bottom left. But just as before, Live Update basically lets you modify your code and see those modifications running live on the platform in literally just a few seconds. So you can test and iterate with your code very, very quickly. And finally, the IDE plugin is now capable of deleting workloads as well. So full lifecycle from create all the way through to delete can be handled inside the IDE. Very, very straightforward, a few clicks and it's done. And of course the uh, Tanzu workload panel will update. 